there! Like my videos? Want to see more? Well, be sure to subscribe and hit that notification bell. Also, leave a like if you like the video. It really helps a lot if you do. Anyways, enjoy the show! Bye! Why, hello everybody, it's me, Kaznova here, otherwise known as Kelsey, and welcome back to a brand new episode of NovaCraft! Today, everyone, I have some exciting news and a thing to go over with you guys. First off, that noise you hear is, yes, a zombie villager. Oh my goodness. Look at this guy. Um, also, guys... As I was playing NovaCraft offline for the past couple of days, I have decided to bring any other villagers um, from that village over that way to our uh, little area over here. So now we have two villagers. Um, here's one of them. He's going to be our lectern uh, villager for now. And then we have another one who is a farmer villager and I'm... Looking to uh, grow the population of villagers soon, um, but this is what the houses are going to look like for now. Um, I did have a house down here that I was going to use, but I took it down because I didn't like how it looked. So we are going to be making a village near our house. It'll be super useful for us. We're also going to work on trying to cure that zombie villager so i think what we're gonna do today everyone is we are going to go to the nether yes that's right it's time to go to the nether i'm super excited to go to the nether to, uh, today we're gonna find another porch hopefully we are lucky enough <laughs> to uh make a nether portal and spawn in front of a what's it called a nether fortress because i really want that luck firsthand that would be very helpful for us um but i don't know how this game is gonna go when we go into the nether so um we're gonna go ahead and suit up also yes uh we have done a lot of decorating as you guys can see, we all have these uh, lantern light things. We have our jukebox over here now. We have a nice purple and white carpet set, a purple bed. Everything's got to be purple in this house. We also have more bookshelves for our enchanting area now and so much more. And I'm super duper excited about this. Um, but oh no, it looks like we were going to have to go for an obsidian run. Um, Hopefully our villager friend doesn't despawn. He does have a name tag because I went fishing and found some name tags finally. Also, one other change is I do have keep inventory on my game now. Mainly because I just don't want to worry about having to um, go and back and find my stuff. So we have to keep inventory which is nice. So if we die, we don't have to worry about losing anything. Um, unless it's like something with curse of vanishing, man, vanishing in it and so forth. So what we're going to do is we're going to go down to the ravine here that is underneath our house. Get some um, handy dandy obsidian. Find another fortress. Cure our zombie villager friend in this episode. And yeah, um, if you guys have any ideas of what we can do for our village in um, our series for NovaCraft, please let me know. It'll be very helpful if we had some ideas. Also, there's a creeper in the skeleton spawner. Okay. Uh, <laughs> there's a creeper down there. I think we're gonna go down more this way. Because I made a little area we can fall down to. Here we go. <laughs> Alright, so gonna kill this creeper also one other thing to note we do have um, infinity on this bow now I need to get ban um, what's it called I need to get uh, mending on it and then I also need to get oh there's so many things we have to get we need to get a uh, silk touch um, which is very handy if we want to start a bee farm which is really what I want to do for some of the series. 
and um, yeah, there's just there's a lot to do, and I'm very excited. <laughs> I have a nice place that I know where I want to put the portal. Um, it's gonna be in our little cave over here, which is nice. I just need to find a way out of here. <laughs> Love not being able to find your way out of a cave. Um, but the first thing before I do put the portal down, I really want to block off the cave just in case any villagers decide I'm going to venture in here. So, <laughs> first things first, let's go to bed. Alright, so it is daytime now and like I said, we're going to block off the cave system before we go and... Um, make this portal. So let's go ahead and get ourselves the supplies to block off that cave system. And um, we do have this wandering trader here, but his trades suck. As usual, all of the trades that the wanderer villag villagers have do not <laughs> do not work. Oh my goodness. So, all right. So what I'm gonna do is gonna gonna I'm gonna put a little gate right here so that villagers don't, you know, make their way around. I'm also going to block this off. Uh, we might need some more. <laughs> Shoot. At least we have a tree farm over here, so if we run out of uh, wood, we always have a place to get more wood, so. All right, so. Let's make a bunch of sticks, make a bunch of fences. Actually, we might want to mine some more um, obsidian so we can have two portals, if that makes sense. Hopefully I'm making it right. Oh my goodness, we don't have enough. <sighs> we have to go back down. I knew I should have grabbed more. Oh. My goodness. That is a lot of Endermen. And he saw me. Oh god, oh god, oh god. I'm sorry, Mr. Enderman. How did you get down here? Did he drop anything? Oh no. Okay. So I think we have enough obsidian now. Hopefully we don't have to make another trip. But I'm just gonna make our way up anyways. It's a good thing that we do it now because there's a zombie. Hi zombie. Die, zombie. <laughs> Alright. Yes. It's a little wonky. It's not the same dimensions as it should be. But it works. And now it is time to go and explore the nether. Are you guys ready? I know I am. I know the first thing we want to do when we get to the nether, though, is we're going to want to... Uh, protect our, you know, our, our bait, our nether once we get in there, so. Ah! He came out of nowhere. Okay then, we're just gonna go in there, I'm scared. <laughs> oh, 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 just what we need. Ah! Uh! That was scary. AF. Okay, let's just, uh... Come on, drop magma cubes. Magma balls. Yes.
We only have one magma keep ball? Rip off. Okay, well, let's just go and, uh... Head back to our portal, fix it up. <laughs> Before we do anything else. There. There's a couple of them. <gasps> Ooh! I really want the magma cubes for those potions. A little space. <clears throat> Hi, little guy. Ah! Uh, why aren't you dropping things? No! What is the drop rate for the the magma cube drop? Like, I just really want magma cream. Okay. Um, may have found a nether fortress. And there's blazes over there. Yes! Oh, they're right there! Already getting blaze rods. Ah, 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 ah. I hate blazes. Charging. Ah, this is a bad idea. This is a bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad idea. Bad. Idea. Bad. 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 Ah! Uh, I need fire resistance. Bad. Destroy this. Grab my blaze rods. <gasps> I got the blaze rods. Okay. Um. Now I think what's next is we need to see if we can make. Yes, we can make a brewing stand. Woo! Okay. Okay. Now that we have our brewing stand, it is now time to make a little place for it. We're gonna just gonna put it right there. We need blaze powder now. <laughs> we need to go back. <sighs> How do you make a fermented spider eye? We need mushrooms and sugar. Okay, so we have a bunch of sugar cane, so we'll just craft that into sugar. We have a few mushrooms. Here we go. Here we go. How to cure a zombie villager. All right, so we just need a splash potion of weakness. But how do we make a splash potion of weakness? Gunpowder. All right, let's grab the little thing. Save our zombie villager friend after we get some glass. <laughs> and make little glasses there we go let's just make all of this into glasses there we go woo all right next thing um doop, boop, doop. and then we need water oh, we made another achievement woo all right we need water 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 water, water. <gasps> is it gonna work is it gonna work I hope it works. I don't know what I'm doing. <laughs> All right, while that's happening, we're gonna go back to the nether to get some brown mushrooms and then call it a day after we cure our zombie villager friend. 
Woo! Okay. This will be the first time I actually kill here a zombie villager, which is exciting. Brown mushrooms! Come to me! I need all of you. For once. Let's cure this zombie villager! Alright. Splash potion of weakness! Yes! We did it! Ah! All we need to do is just get this, um... We just need to get some more blaze rods. Well, blaze powder for the future and blaze rods. And then we also just need... Ah! I'm so excited! We have a golden apple. Uh, but we might want to make some more golden apples just in case. Uh, apples... All right, we got some golden apples here. Amazing. All right, let's cure our zombie villager friend. This is actually so much fun. to quit this game. <laughs> well, that sucked. We tried to cure a zombie villager and then it failed. Again. Why do I suck at this? <laughs> Wait, so how do you... Okay, everyone. Well, I think that is it for this episode of Nova Craft. It's probably a good thing I gave myself the weakness for karma because, like, I don't know what's going on anymore. <laughs> if you guys like this episode, be sure to leave a like, comment down below what you guys think I should do next episode. And as always, I will see you all in the next galaxy. Bye!